So this ice cream, ice cream box is filled with sand and gravel and uh, according to a digital scale it's 4010 grams, 4, 4 kilograms and uh, that is approximately the weight of a red epic camera with a little zoom lens on. This is uh, 2nd of July and I will make a test flight with an uh, octacopter from Carbon Core uh, with uh, all up weight of uh, 10.3 kilograms. The payload is 4 kilograms. We will have a flight time of uh, less than 5 minutes and we will see if the copter will cope with it at all. Hang on. Okay, let's go. We'll begin flying in ATI mode and then switch over to GPS lock. It's hovering at um, 1.6 or 1.7 kilowatts. The Eagle Tree uh, telemetry reports 3,200 RPM on one of the motors. Okay, let's switch to GPS mode. There we are. seem to be working pretty hard. A little turbulence from the wind. Motor temperature seems to be uh, 45 degrees. like 115 amperes. Now consumed 3.3 milliampere hours. Okay Per, då kommer jag ge lite lyft så den stiger. Kan du se till att du hänger med när den drar iväg uppåt? Let's try some max lift. Well, it's not too, uh, too quick, but it did uh, climb. Let's try some uh, back and forth flying. Coping pretty well, but it's a bit sluggish. There we have the temporary low volt warning. Still, we should have some more minutes.
This is the primary voltage warning. We still have the secondary to come on. At that point, I will uh, go for an immediate landing. Uh, it's pretty sluggish in vertical axis. No wonder it's really heavy. Really high disc load on the propellers. Still, there is minor lifting capacity when I order it. Not so impressive, but it's controllable. Okay, so there we have um, another separate voltage warning and the secondary, so I'm landing. to manual mode. So, backing to the left by some reason. Suppose uh, I would uh, need to uh, raise the, the game. It had a pretty good, a pretty good vertical performance there. That obviously upset uh, at the uh, calculation.